or Kn Eon that lasted for about 4.6 billion years. Earth's History at Precambrian Time ABC presents Reach Up to the Bottom Thank you, thank you. Welcome to everyone's favorite game show, Reach Up to the Bottom. Today's contestant, Joe, has just entered our bonus round and is trying to win our grand prize. Now that he's here, he will be given a chance to travel back to one of the eras during the Precambrian time. Are you ready? Yes, I am. So let's get started. Hmm. I'll choose Archean Eon. But what is the Archean Eon? The Archean Eon began about 4 billion years ago with the formation of the Earth's crust and extended to the start of the Proterozoic Eon. Four events happened at that time. The Neo-Archean spans the period from 2.5 to 2.8 billion years ago. This era is credited with the formation of the supercontinent called Kennerland due to the result of a series of accretion events and the formation of new continental crust. During this time, the supercontinent Vaalbara broke apart and eventually formed the supercontinent known as Kennerland. Biological event The beginning of oxygenic photosynthesis occurred during the Neoarchean era. This eventually led to a major catastrophic event during the Paleoproterozoic era in which the amount of oxygen in the atmosphere was poisonous to anaerobic life which is namely called the Oxygen Catastrophe. In this time period, oxygen was released into the atmosphere while the Earth was cooling down. The atmosphere was mostly composed of nitrogen, carbon, hydrogen, and volcanic gases. During this era, most of the Earth was covered in oceans. They were around 26 to 35 degrees Celsius and was rich in carbon. This era occurred around 2.8 to 3.2 billion years ago. The Mesoarchean era began at the time when the first macroscopic fossils, stromatolites, were known, and ended at the time when the first continental flood basalts were known. The supercontinent of Baal Bara was formed in the Paleoarchean era. It existed throughout the entirety of the Mesoarchean era before breaking up during the Neoarchean era. The continent known as Ur was formed during the Mesoarchean era. The geology of this time period includes vast amount of water. As oxygen continued to be used up in oxidizing minerals in the Earth's crust and sea, oxygen levels remain very low in the atmosphere. Oceans were consisted of liquid water when the planet cooled. Paleoarchean era occurred around 3.2 to 3.6 billion years ago. There was an evidence of non oxygen producing plants in this time period. There were very little oxygen levels in the atmosphere. The plants on the Earth at this point had still not begun to provide oxygen through photosynthesis. Oceans were being formed as the continents were formed in the Hadden Sea. When these continents formed the openings, it began to fill up with liquid water which resulted in low oxygen levels in the
The year Archean spans the period from 3.6 to 4 billion years ago. During this era, the Earth's crust was firm and solid for the first time. This was the first phase of Earth the solid rock survived. There were no plants but there were microorganisms living such as cyanobacteria which is a blue-green algae that produced oxygen as a metabolic product that later proved to be fatal to other organisms. The oceans were made up of gases such as ferrous ion mixed with oxygen and the temperatures were hot because of the gases. Done! I'm glad I was able to discover those things. Welcome back, Joe. You completed your task. Now pack your things since you're all set for tomorrow. Congratulations! It's a pleasure to be part of this game show. Till next time! That's all the time we have for today's episode. See you again tomorrow. Maybe. This is Reach Up to the Bottom. Goodbye!